Number 13. The Voynich Manuscript The world's most mysterious manuscript was discovered in 1912 in northern Italy, and its perplexing nature is due to the fact that the language, scribe, and author still remain a mystery. Titled the Voynich Manuscript, archaeologists claim that out of the 240 pages intact, too many are missing to be able to decipher exactly what information this wondrous text may reveal. All that is known are through some simple drawings, that is, a variation of herbal plants, which make for the most fascinating aspect of the Voynich Manuscript. Until now, no one has been able to match these sketches to any known plant species. What's speculated is that the work was written in the 15th century, and apart from the herbal section, the document contains astronomical, biological, cosmological, and pharmaceutical information as well. What does this mean? No one has ever been able to tell. Number 12. Machu Picchu Rediscovered by Hiram Bingham in 1911, this colossal lost Inca citadel was built in the mid-15th century on a dramatic mountaintop overlooking Peru. Its stunning natural surroundings and awe-inspiring standing remains make this a truly remarkable sight, a striking reminder of the technological capabilities and power of the Inca Empire at its peak. Its terraced platforms and cave cemeteries allow a fascinating insight into the lives of the 1,000 or so people who had once lived here. Number 11. Nazca Lines This curious creation is best seen from the sky, and those who fly over the desert of southern Peru have the pleasure of witnessing an anomaly better known as Nazca Lines. Here, these unusual formations of white lines have made the area a popular UNESCO World Heritage Site, as many flock to see the otherworldly sand inscriptions for themselves. The ancient mind-blowing formation features the shapes of trapezoids, rectangles, triangles, and swirls. And by making an even closer observation, one can spot 70 animals as well as detailed plant structures and 300 other geometrical shapes. While the purpose of the work of art is unknown, archaeologists have determined that Nazca lines were created by Nazca Indians between 500 BCE and 700 CE, an estimation which puts these lines at around 2,000 years old. It's amazing that the creations have remained intact for so long, and of course, a large community of believers blame aliens for the nature of such skilled imagery. Number 10. Gobekli Tepe This next find marks one of the oldest archaeological sites in the world. Located in Turkey, Gobekli Tepe is a construction which serves to remind of the high level of artistic power held by the Stone Age people 11,000 years ago. They used limestone pillars weighing 15 to 22 tons to build their masterpiece, cut down from huge blocks of rocks. And this was no small job either. The team stumbled upon 200 of these perfectly polished cylinders during their expedition. Soon, the archaeologists put enough data together to reason that Gobekli Tepe was a temple of the ancient people, a stark discovery which led to more in-depth study of the Neolithic Revolution. Number 9. Terracotta Army One of the most fascinating archaeological discoveries to date occurred in 1974 when a group of archaeologists in Xi'an, China made an excavation which became the discovery of the greatest funeral art ever, the Terracotta Army. The team found thousands of clay soldiers buried near the tomb of Emperor Qin Shu Huang, the first emperor of China. The clay soldiers were buried with their ruler as protection from different forces of nature they believed arose after death. Altogether, the ancient complex is presumed to be around 2,200 years old. Along with the soldiers, archaeologists found many different weapons alongside the sculptures, perfectly arranged and laid out within the various clay corridors. 
Of the four main parts that comprise the entire work of art, three pits are filled with the terracotta army and weapons. Yet the fourth remains completely empty. There are many parts of the complex, as well as the tomb of Qin Shi Huang, that, to this day, are left unexcavated. Number 8. Moai Statues, Easter Island In the southern Pacific Ocean looms a massive volcanic island. Upon this island are giant stone statues. But who put them there? The Moai statues of Easter Island are one of the most mysterious and iconic archaeological discoveries ever made. These statues are the main attraction to this treeless remote abode in Chile. What is known is that the Moai stone faces were carved by the ancient people of Rapa Nui between 1300 and 1500 CE. And there are 887 of the astonishing relics in total, situated in various massive stone platforms around the island. The sculptures were thought to be giant, disproportioned heads sticking out of the ground. With a height of 13 feet and weight of approximately 80 tons, until recent discovery showed that there are bodies attached as well, albeit underground. The Rapa Nui people used volcanic rocks to carve the masterpiece piece by puzzling piece, and their mystery stems from the mere scope of their size. As anyone who sets eyes on these astonishing stone figures can't help but ask, how a primitive group of people constructed these beings, and more importantly, how did they transport them? Number 7. Tutankhamun's Tomb, Egypt While the reign of this ruler may have been short-lived and otherwise politically unimportant, this is arguably one of the most spectacular discoveries of all time. When Howard Carter's excavation at the Valley of the Kings in 1922 revealed a teenage king who died far too soon, his tomb, packed with the most beautiful objects in the world, certainly showed off his royal status. The tomb was such a treasure trove with which to show high honor and respect for a pharaoh, it was remarkable that the loot managed to escape thieving hands for all that time. This epic discovery made King Tut more legendary than in the short time he was alive. Number 6. Knossos Crete the finds by archaeologist Arthur Evans between 1900 and 1905 uncovered a vast Middle Bronze Age palace from 1450 BCE. The excavation unearthed some 1300 rooms, many decorated with beautifully detailed dolphins, griffins, and athletes engaged in the old sport of bull leaping. The most important find of all, however, was, at first glance, nothing special. Upon further inspection, however, archaeologists discovered thousands of slabs of baked clay. The tablets bore inscriptions in a never-before-seen language, soon to be called Linear B. No one could read the foreign letters, of course, and it wasn't until 50 years later when Michael Ventris cracked the code, making Linear B the oldest deciphered language in Europe. Number 5. Sutton Hoo England. For anyone who is into ship burials and Viking antiquity, then revel in a find that shaped history. When an archaeologist by the name of Basic Brown excavated a group of low grassy mounds in Suffolk, England, what he discovered was monumental. A huge intact ship burial containing the richest haul of Anglo-Saxon grave goods ever found. We're talking imported Byzantine objects, enigmatic religious symbols, recreational objects, and weaponry, including the world-famous helmet, which allowed historians a vivid peek into the Anglo-Saxon world and what it was like back then. Number 4. The Rosetta Stone This find was remarkable in that it lent the key to our understanding of hieroglyphics more than a thousand years after knowledge of how to read the ancient Egyptian symbols had faded from memory. Napoleon's army discovered the stone during the construction of a fort, and quickly took notice that the slab offered a trilingual inscription written in Greek, Demotic, and hieroglyphics. 
The Greek writing was all that the French schoolteacher Jean-Francois Champollion needed to crack the code. And in 1822, he published a full translation. Number 3. The Lost City of Atlantis Perhaps one of the most mysterious finds ever? The Lost City of Atlantis was a myth for many years, until divers uncovered a city beneath the waves. In 360, Plato wrote of a magic metropolis which sank into the ocean, and later researchers came to believe that a tsunami hit the city in the 10th millennium BCE, sinking the whole of Atlantis into the ocean. The actual truth of the ancient city remains unknown, except that traces of Greek infrastructure resembling ancient carvings, pillars, roadways, and steps have been found at the bottom of the sea. What's more, conspiracy theorists swear that Atlantis lies within the Bermuda Triangle, as traces of a Greek city wall have been found embedded in the stone surrounding the Bimini Islands. While the story of Atlantis remains a theory, these detailed remnants led proof that a city bearing all likeness to Plato's was once very much alive and real. Number 2. Stonehenge in Salisbury, England, there stands another mysterious formation of rocks known as Stonehenge. The 5,000-year-old monument is the source of many conspiracies, from everything to aliens and cult sacrifice. While very little is actually known of the purpose of Stonehenge, one fact remains – that prehistoric man had a helping hand in making this site a sacred place. Knowing what was so sacred lends to its great mystery, although archaeologists have found the site to be an ancient burial ground, and others point to the sky, claiming the mounds of rocks were a pinnacle for superhighway alien activity. The monument in total is conceived of a number of small and large stones, with the larger exhibiting a height of 30 feet and a weight of 25 tons. Constructed between 3000 BCE and 2000 BCE, archaeologists have estimated that Neolithic builders brought huge stones from Priscelli Hills, a location 150 miles from the wondrous monument. Number 1. The Great Pyramids Pyramids are the greatest ancient structures ever seen on Earth. And even though many civilizations built pyramids, the Egyptian pyramids stand out all on their own. It is this uniqueness that makes the Great Pyramid of Giza one of the top wonders of the ancient world. It is estimated that Egyptians began constructing the pyramids in 2700 BCE, mainly as a tomb for preserving the mummified bodies of royal members. The Great Pyramid of Giza is the oldest and tallest pyramid in Egypt, with a height of 481 feet. This wonder took almost 20 years to build, using millions of limestones, and inside, one can revel in the valuable treasures and elaborate exteriors, hosting intricate paintings and carvings reminiscent of an ancient world. Thanks for watching. If you could visit one, the Terracotta Army, or Machu Picchu, where would you go?